youtube.com slash Tim Westwood TV. Tim Westwood TV, I'm a cabin like smoke poke, baby. Tim slash Westwood TV, let's the get it! Drop the bomb! You Tim know. Westwood TV. Family, yo, you tied Juice World in the one hour freestyle. That's crazy. Hey, Juice World, I'm coming for you, yo, boy. Do, do I feel a battle? I don't know. Do I feel a battle up in this room? There's there's an hour. He did an hour. I did an hour. We might both have to come here at the same time and go back and forth. That's a lot of beats, fam. I was running out of beats. I ain't going to lie. And next time I'm going to sit down. So what do you think about my freestyle? <laughs> Craze. What do you think? Relentless. Okay. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. P pressure. Okay, okay. So the Juice Road. Juice Road, I just tied you. I just tied you for the one hour freestyle. On and popping. When you came into this building, you was ready. Yes, I sir. See that. Yes, sir. But let's let's talk about when you came into the building. Like, this killed me, man. You walk in and say, "Damn, I've just lost a ring." How much was the ring? So I walked in the building <laughs> and I noticed that I lost a thirty thousand dollar ring. Thirty <laughs> k ring, fam. And let me be honest, you were blasé. You were saying, "Where is the nearest jeweler? I'm gonna replace it and get a chain." Yeah. So I lost my I lost my ring. So I asked Tim. I'm like. Who's the best jeweler? I'm gonna go buy more jewelry. <laughs> Talks about Mario. <laughs> was, Mario, like, I need I, the address. I, I tell you, man, that would have been a vibe killer for me. I'd be like, fuck this, I'm going back to the hotel. <laughs> I would have been like, yo, I'm sitting in the room with the lights out. That's how I would have been. <laughs> no, you were man. like, blase. No, I'm and I was out. explaining the pound was weak, but you were saying, like, I'm gonna spend my dollars. No, 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 yeah, of course, of course. Mad. Mad, I lost a ring, I'm buying three but, of them. But let's be honest, the tour manager found the ring. He found it, but I'm still buying more. <laughs> <laughs> what are you rocking right now? Right the now, Gucci links are right crazy. Now, right now, I'm wearing the... You can feel that. That's heavy. It's super heavy. Solid. You solid. That? You know these Gucci links used to be hollow in the old days. This mm -hmm. is solid. Yeah, you see that? Yeah, yeah. Made by oh. Aviani. Shout out Aviani. I got the, all day. the really big Cuban, the prong The setting. Cuban is crazy. So uh, this together is about uh, almost 300,000 right here. And then I got the... Oh, and then I And then I got the... Uh, and I got the 30 pointers. Crazy. It's like a good uh, 38,000. Heavyweight. I got the. Um, the Rollies craze. No, this is AP. This is AP, baby. Come on, baby. Let's step the game up. I got the AP. That's yeah, around. That's yeah. around. Uh, that's six. the one with diamonds inside the watch as well as outside. <laughs> Everywhere. I can't. Shine. Uh, what time? You can't read the time. What time you is it? What the fuck is the time? You know what, what I'm saying? Time? I'm Ooh. saying I'm about to put some baguettes in here, it, 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 right here. So that's like around between. seventy, eighty thousand. Um, I got, I got okay, another Gucci link right the, the here. Gucci link is beautiful. Right here, twenty thousand. Rocking. Right and there. And the pinkies. Ringing. And then I got the, and then I got the little pointers. I like those pointers, man. Two little, two little yeah, pointers, probably yeah. about Classy. ten, ten thousand each. And then I got the, the really, really big heavy star ring. Pinky. Feel how heavy that is. That's thirty-five thousand on my pinky. That's actually a thumb ring for me, fam. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy. And then I got a, and then I got the flaw the the flawless grill. Yeah, the this is not this is not SI, not BS, not BVS. This is flawless. Flawless. See that? Yeah. Flawless. And that's good for the mouth. Yeah. It makes the food taste expensive. Oh no, no, I don't eat with them on. Oh, sorry. But they look permanent, right? <laughs> they look burnt. Yo, fam. And they go all the way back. Hmm. That's cha ching right there. Tim Westwood TV! Drop the bomb. Now, um, last day of the tour. Let's celebrate that. Let's yep. celebrate that. Are you that. coming to the show? Oh, but I'm sitting upstairs. I'm of not course. Built for a mosh You're backstage. Pit. You're Yo, backstage with me. Thank you, fam. I'm not built for a mosh pit. Yeah. Definitely Seriously, not that I'm not one. built. No. Definitely not no, that No, that's going to be the wall of death in there, fam. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not partaking. Yeah. Some, mosh. Dude, some dude broke his neck yesterday. They brought the stretcher in there and everything. Yo, wasn't there another? Wasn't there another? Never mind. That, that those mosh is no joke. Yes, yeah, no joke. W when it's super turned like that, even against the wall, ain't safe. Yeah, you know. I mean, I I, I encourage them to turn up, but I don't encourage them exactly. to fight. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I always, yeah. I always, whenever there's a fight or something, I I, I stop everything. Exactly. I break it up. Yeah. I, I don't like yeah. none of that shit. I don't like really, that for your shows, you say skinny guys and women upstairs, mosh pit down. Hmm? That's why they should separate the balconies should be for the no, women. No, the girls be mosh pitting too. <laughs> the girls don't care. But the girls mosh pit to the front, so I could yeah. pick, so I could pick one of them. <laughs> and do you be picking up? Like, I'm here. <laughs> I'm here, baby. I'm putting up with this mosh pit just so I can get a little shine. And then I just give it a look. I just is that the look? And then I'd be like, Garrett. 
Oh, is that is that the uh, picker? Garrett. What the white dude? So I look at a girl. Yeah. I'm like, all right. Follows the stare. She looked twenty some, and I'm like, yes, please, I please, go to the please, side. please. I go to the side. Yeah. I'm like, Garrett, go check her ID. Garrett gets okay. off stage. Exactly. <laughs> Checks the ticket. ID scan. Yeah. yeah. I got I got my amazing manager with me. Pick him up all Mongo day. Vision. Donut eater. Who ate all the donuts? Yeah, he ate like 36 donuts. 30, f- f- unmerciful. But he was tidying up. <laughs> yeah, well... I, I mean, know. shit, yeah, it, was, it was an hour-long That's, freestyle. Yeah, he was looking like a cop over there eating those donuts. I ain't yeah, gonna find I, I thought they, I thought they brought the truck. Yeah. Smashed it. So, the picker is an, an important role. I've seen pickers over the years from Teddy Riley and Guy. They used to have pickers. What do you mean, pickers? For the, the shorties at the front to come backstage for the after party. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Garrett's the, the picker. Yeah, he's an important <laughs> role. Garrett, Garrett's the photographer you can't, and the picker. You can't trust security for that role. No, no, no. because they'll just be bring thick set women back for themselves. Especially not, not him. He's oh, him? Oh, no, 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 no. He looks selfish like that. No, no, no. That's a, Mi- yeah. that's a Miami Haitian right oh, there. Oh, d- d- it's trouble. Shout out oh, Showcase. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Look at and him. Yeah. Look at him over there. And if he doesn't get <laughs> you the punch in the face, he'll put some voodoo on that ass. <laughs> <laughs> Let's put that woo on you. Days. Put that woo on you. Oh, woo. Yeah, man. Yeah, I, when I, I see- lost my ring, I know he was in the car oh. doing something. Yeah, yeah, with he the doll. The- I saw it. <laughs> yeah, the he doll. was in the car doing <laughs> something. <the> doll. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that voo ain't no joke for him. So- All of a sudden, the ring popped up. What the hell? <laughs> yes. How? How did he do that? Yo, there was one time I lost his chain. Oh, my. You clumsy out there. I don't know what happened. He's like, you're going to find it. Five minutes later, they found a chain. I'm like, yo, this yo, I don't know what's going yo. on here. Oh, no. <laughs> that food is powerful, fam. <laughs> that food too is powerful, man. Let's not fuck with it. <laughs> hey, not me. Hey. Shout out to Florida, man. Shout out to Florida. Oh, we from man. the bottom of the bottom. We from the island. You know what I'm saying? We're our own island. Nobody taught like us. Nobody got our lingo. You know what I'm saying? These, oh, the swag. These, these, these green ass jits trying to take the lingo, <laughs> but they can't take the lingo. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? Ty, that flies everywhere. You know what I'm saying? They can't take the lingo. It's Florida shit. Exactly. You don't understand deep. any of that. No, but I just <laughs> I caught a couple of words and I just walked with it. Exactly. Oh, Florida, crazy man. I respect that man. And we ain't talking the beach. No, hell. hell I mean, no. I mean, I like the beach. The beach but is, you know, fun parties. No, yeah, nice yeah, clubs. yeah. But I'm from Carroll City. Yeah, hard. Carroll City. That's the realness. Carroll City, Opelika. Exactly. Yeah. Good food spots out there as well. Good food spots, yeah. but they also shoot first forty eight oh, there. Oh yes, of course. <laughs> yes, let's not front. That's why you go to a drive Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, that's but Florida you go to a drive But Florida through. but Florida's a Florida's a beautiful place yeah. to visit. Florida's beautiful, it's just But it's you know, real. It's real. It it just it just depends just don't go to the wrong spot, you know. Yeah. Yeah. But there's it's it's really it's really it's really small areas that are mm. like that. But Florida is a beautiful place, mm. beautiful beaches, a lot of beaches, mm. everything. You know what I'm saying? Anything you could think of, you can do in Florida. We got we got the original the original Disney World there. Whoa. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <It's> just... <laughs> Thank you. Get it! Oh. Takes me back when I was in the Mickey Mouse Club. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Oh, man. Much thank you. going to fuck this up. <laughs> no. Right. First things first, man. Oh, you uh, a lot new music. Sourced like this. Tic Tac. Yo, you want to know Mosh. something? You want to know something? I love you, bro, because somebody sent me a video... Like they weren't playing sauce like this on the radio yet, but somebody sent me a video of you of you playing sauce like this, and I was like, damn, because it's like it didn't work as much in the U in the U S than it did over here. Hmm. Like when I came over here is when I started hearing it on the radio. Thanks for the love, like, man. Like like in the U K. Thanks for paying like attention. Germany. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah no. Ger- like overseas is where 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 sauce like this really picked up. Oh, really picked, picked up. up more. Yeah, and it, it's a great mosh record. Yeah. It's, it's like built for that. And what I like about that that minute thirty, perfect. Yeah. Minute, Sometimes you want things like fast. That. Yeah. I like keeping it quick and simple. Yeah. Especially when uh, especially when it's like a that song was just to 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 give something to my old fans. You mm. know what I'm saying? Because that was more like a a mosh pit song and i'm trying to 
I'm I'm still making that yes, type of obviously, music. Obviously, uh, since I'm making obviously, that type of music, obviously. but but I make music, music too. Like yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like that. Like I make pop. And I write pop like as as I don't know if yeah. you've seen my credits, but I I wrote a lot of I, I wrote a lot of like, I wrote I a lot it, of songs like, on, I love it. That, on the yo, top Billboard. Crazy, yeah. It's yeah. not fun. Yeah, and I, 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 and, it, I, like, and, I and I produce all my beats. Yes. I did film, like you yeah. know what I'm saying. All that. Yeah, let's not understand you as an artist. Like let's most put one thing, you as an artist, the next thing. Yeah, and powerful times now. Yeah, exactly. And the cha-ching must be crazy. I can see why you're iced and dripping. Hey, man. That publishing, we coming in. Oh, yeah. The publishing coming in. <laughs> the publishing coming the publishing in. Coming home, man. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and you signed to Cactus Jack. I'm signed. To, I'm signed to Interscope. Yes. But Cactus Jack is gang. It's fam. Yeah, that's gang. fam. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. Like early on, especially yeah. early on, Travis. You know, he hit me. Yeah. And he was like, "Yo, I, I fuck with you. I want you to be, you know." I want you to be around. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I'll get you a chain made and everything. You're Cactus Jack. You yes. know, like, I fuck with you. You don't mm. got to sign no papers. Mm. You, you know see, those saying? and those early co-signs mean all the difference, man. Yeah, so, he, so, the basi difference. so basically, it was, just, it was just like, you know, you don't you don't got to sign no papers. You, you're with us. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it was like a lot of love. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But but I'm signed to Interscope. I work with, I work with Interscope. I work with uh, Alamo and Universal. Oh, whoa. So... The writing you do and the producing you do, I mean, like, the list is pretty intense. Yeah. I mean, the, I did not know you did the Kanye joint. I love it. How the fuck is everybody finding out? It's, thank God you're telling people. I did not tell nobody shit. <laughs> you told shit. me. You told <laughs> I ain't tell nobody shit. Kanye, I need them fucking papers, son. I need my money, man. Yeah, for real. <laughs> I might really say. No, nah, I'm playing. I love you, Kanye. <laughs> yeah, we love Kanye. Kanye, you're the GOAT, bro. Yeah. Kanye through and through, man. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I wrote the, I did the the Kanye and uh, and and pump. I, I love it, which yeah. was um, it went number. Brought Kanye it back. went and went. Uh, yeah, biggest Brought, uh, biggest yes. song in ten years. Yes, exactly. So it was that, that went up everywhere. to number two on the Billboard, and then yeah. it went up to number one on yes. Urban. Yes, and rightfully yeah. so. And rocking the parties to this day, shutting mm -hmm. shit down. Yes, sir. And I'm still, and, and there's still songs that I've written that you don't know. You know what I'm saying? There's still songs that like made such it. as like what? Like I can't say. I, like ones I don't know. You know that's confidential. Oh, is it? Yeah. These things do come. I up. told you this one yes. because you brought it up. Yes. Well, I was playing. They brought it up. And they brought it, it up. And yes. I was yes. like, how are people finding yeah. out? Like, yeah, yeah. Well, I actually knew, but I, I just wanted to put it out there on the low low. Yeah, 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 yeah. I wrote that. Yeah. Mm. It was it, actually on. It was actually on Pump's birthday. Oh whoa! Oh, you yeah. missed him. So we were we were in Miami. It was in Miami, right, Josh? Yeah. We were in Miami. We he we had he had the little studio set up, and then Kanye called, and he was just like, "Yo, I need you, guy. I need you to do something on this beat." And like the beat didn't really have any drums yet. It was just mm -hmm. it, it was just mm 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 mm. It didn't have the mm -hmm. yet. So nobody was able to come up with nothing. <laughs> And then, because <laughs> it's never the drums. Yes, because it was nothing it's, but the eight oh eight. So yeah. and I just, I just went in there and I just did my thing, and uh, so you put the magic on it. I I put the magic on it. Uh, you know the CB the producer, mm. he put a little bit of drums on it. You know pump. Uh, they re-record. They re-recorded mm. everything I did mm. and all that, and uh, yeah, mad. What a moment! What a time to be alive. Uh. But you know, I'm not. I'm not trying to discredit no, anybody's work no, or nothing. Not at all. Everybody had their own input on yeah. it. You know, I'm not trying to discredit nobody's work. Pump did his thing. Kanye did his thing. It's and just you did Tim Wessler brought it yeah, up, not me. Yeah, and I had. I asked about it, and I really, you know, using skillful interviews and interrogation techniques, I managed to draw it out of you, yeah. and I appreciate doing that. And it's I feel all good. You feel I'm an open book. You can ask I, me anything. I, I, yeah, I, I know you feel pretty exposed right now. Mm -hmm. Thank you for sharing. Yeah, ask me anything. <laughs> okay, what other joints have you produced? Um, that goes for it. No, no, no. Sorry, 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 sorry. So what's happening? Um, any uh, Gucci gang, nigga? Gucci, oh, oh yeah, that Gucci gang, yeah, nigga. Yo. I made that shit. <laughs> Gucci gang is no. my song. I gave oh, you that my song. Days. Pump. I need my Stop Gucci stealing. gang money. There's a lot of theft going on, man. Especially with that little pump. 
<laughs> Especially with that little pump. Shout out, little pump, man. Oh That's my god, brother, bro. oh yo, yo, nephew, man. What yo and Gucci Gang Supergroup. Gucci Gang, yeah, yeah. Me, me, Gucci Mane, and Lil Pump. Yeah, yeah, we're performing at Coachella yeah. this year. Magic, but I, I think you and Little Pump, crazy combo, man. I, yeah. I, I, Gucci Mane's my hero, but you, uh, uh, it's a Pump different is, energy. Yeah, yeah, it's it's the new energy, man. Yeah, it's the new new hip hop, man. And we love it, man. Thank you, man. I and it's li- beyond belief, and everything calm with him. We're with, with Gucci. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's yeah. really calm. Yeah, we're all. All love, man. We're all... All fam. We're all... He gave us mm. 1017 chains. He gave me his that said CEO on the back. So, we, we got 1017 chains and all that. Mm. Perfect, man. Um, Coachella's going to be a big moment. Big, big moment. Yeah. And you'll shut that down. It's crazy. What, um, what do you normally spend your money on besides strip? Well, last year I spent too much money on bullshit. Serious, what like? Oh, man. Cars? Uh, just, I was, I bought, I was just buying a new outfit every day. I was just losing, losing everything I was buying. I was losing. I was buying jewelry, losing it. Like now, now more is just, I've been, I've been really saving my money. Right. But like, when I when I want to buy something like a piece of jewelry, you're buying. They they allow me because yeah. I don't waste as much on you. Yeah. I'm not going stupid so, how I was before. Was it a crazy? Because I have an accountant. Oh, but was it? And then you speak to him about getting the dough. You know, like you releasing some checks and who the accountant? My accountant. Yeah. Or, oh yeah 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 yeah. Or she let you know what's going on. It's it's a girl. Yeah. She she lets me know. She lets me know what's going on. Yeah. Like I get I yes. get my cash flow report and yeah. all that. Like perfect. But how crazy was it then back? Like a year it ago. was it was it was bad because like like I told you I'm an open book like I was just I was just on them drugs, really you know I was just drugged up doing stupid shit buying a whole bunch of shit losing all the shit buying jewelry losing all the jewelry, and like you know I just had to I mean, you yeah I just, I, just, that role. Yeah. I just had to get sober yeah and once I got sober I just you know yeah how was that detox man? I mean it wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't too bad. I feel like maybe it's because I'm kind of young, mm. and I never really got. I never really got too deep into like. I never got into like heroin and like stuff like that. It was really, really mostly the lean. Mm. But what it was is like the lean was getting me fat as fuck. True indeed. <laughs> that lean be making you fat. So I was like, man. My manager was like, man, fuck that lean shit. And yeah. Then, uh, yeah. And I just started drinking THC syrup. <laughs> Yeah, that lean will give you titties, man. Purpovis, go buy it now at any dispensary <laughs> near you. I mean, for real, man. That that, that lean, it, 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 yo, it can slow your roll and everything, man. Make yeah, you super nah, fat. Yeah, nah, and it's crazy because you think it doesn't, but then mm. you're in a situation and you're like, oh, wait, hold up, I need my lean. Oh, wait, hold up, I need my lean. Oh, wait, hold up, I need my lean. And like... And you got to think about it. The whole time you're drinking lean is soda, soda, soda. You're drinking lean all day. You're drinking soda all from morning till night, a year straight. You know what I'm saying? Like, I I was like, so so when I before I started drinking lean, I was like 180. When I stopped drinking lean, I was like 217. Ooh. Now I'm and like, probably didn't even realize. Yeah. Now I'm like, I'm not 180, but I'm like I'm like 191. You're fighting back. I'm 191. Yeah, you're fighting back. So I'm like 11 pounds away from. Where Did I was. you find that you your creative process was the same? Matter of fact, I went up to 234 Whoa. actually. Yeah, I went up to 234. That, that would have been crazy. Yeah, and then um. So unhealthy. Thankfully, I have a good manager. Yeah. Who got me off the lean and uh, made you wake up from how, from 234 to to 191? How much weight is that? 47, 43. So yeah, like in from yeah. so from like November till now, I lost wow. like forty something. Yeah. Pounds. Did you find your creative process was the same, or did you find you needed the <laughs> no, lean? No, it was hard. Was it, it was, hard? It was hard. But it's, it's, but it was hard because it was hard because like I told you, I'm an open book. Like I was never a rapper. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I wasn't a rapper. I I sold drugs. You know what I'm saying? That's what I did. I sold acid in school. Like this was the time that that acid rap came out. So I was selling acid and I was selling Xanax and like I never sold weed because I just smoked it. So I was just selling drugs around the rappers, and then in the mix of that, I started I started rapping, but I was already on drugs. Mm. So so when I stopped um so when I stopped doing drugs, it was hard to rap because 
I started rapping like while I was doing drugs. Yeah. I didn't rap and then do drugs. Yeah. I did drugs and then I rapped. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So when I stopped doing drugs, I was like, what the fuck? Like, yeah. What the fuck do I do now? And sometimes it's, it's not that it, it's part of the creative process, but you're just used to being high when you're being creative. It's exactly. not like it gives you that creativity, but you just, when you are creative, you're just used to having the yeah, lead. Exactly. But, uh, um, the head of uh, the head of uh, uh, of Alamo, Todd Moskowitz, he had told he told me some wise shit. He told me he was like, "Yo, if you're," he had told me, "If you're doing this on on these drugs, it's because you're doing it. You don't need the drugs to doing it. It's still you doing it. You're just altering your mind. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then I just stuck that to my head, and then that's what's been working yeah. for me. Because I think a lot of people, I still smoke weed. Don't get me wrong. Oh, yeah, I yeah, smoke yeah, weed. No, like, no. you know what I'm saying? But a lot, I think a lot of people think they need the lean or the drugs to be part of that creative process but I think as you say the creative process is you if anything yeah, they exactly, just came in exactly. the way they it's just like put the, a filter it's, on it's really, it's really in you it's really not mm. it's really not the drugs it's yeah. really coming out of you exactly it's just I guess the drugs help it come out better or something mm, but mm. once you get the hang of it you know it's easy you don't need you don't need nothing you don't yeah. need liquor I don't even drink liquor or nothing like that perfect so. do you feel there's a major issue now with it like lean with it like in hip hop with a lot of the young artists I mean I think there's always been a I think lean has always been around mm. you know uh, R.I.P. Pimp C that's not a problem you know shout out Houston Texas shout out everybody sipping lean out there I think the problem right now is Oxycontin right right I think the problem right now is Oxycontin because I don't think people understand that like Oxycontin is not a Percocet like a Percocet is not an Oxycontin you're doing if you're doing two or three 30 milligram Oxycontins you're doing heroin fam you're not doing you're mm. not doing Oxycontin you're doing heroin you know what I'm saying it's a painkiller there's levels you know what I'm saying it goes Norco it goes Percocet it goes Oxycontin it goes morphine and then it goes heroin so if you're taking two or three Oxycontins a day you're doing heroin you know what I'm saying and I think that's a problem because when they ever when they when they try to stop it's, it's gonna you know i seen yeah. it i seen it with my eyes you know what i'm saying i never i'm not ever i never really got into the oxy shit i got into the perk shit a little bit really early but really my shit was just was just lean mm. like i wasn't mm. you know what and, I'm saying? Uh, but, and the, that addictiveness of it man is a killer man it's Coming not it's not it's, not it's not it's not even the addictiveness of the oxycodone it's the withdrawals of it that's that's bad mm. that makes you want to take another one you know what I'm saying? Thankfully, I've never had to go through that. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, hard times out there for people, man. Well, I really want, appreciate you coming through, fam. Uh, any more tats? The, the, the tat game, the face oh, tat game tats. is real uh, cool, man. I got, I got a skull down yes. here. Mm. Let me see. Oh, I just got a big ass. <laughs> I got the lean yeah. bottle right here. <laughs> Yo, you might as well paint the history, man. I got the bat wings on my neck. Yeah, they look crazy. And uh, yeah, man. So I want everybody to know that. Uh, Did you have any near death experiences? Yeah. Did that make you wake up? Hell yeah. And I had what two. I had two actually. And what are they? Are they really thinking where you feel it's done? Huh? Okay, you, you feel like the game is over? No. Nah, yeah. Like the first time. The first time. This was like I was like seventeen. Whoa. Right. I was like I was in. How old are you now? I, I'm twenty one. What? So this is like I, I wasn't even like rapping mm. like that, and then I was just chilling with a homeboy, and he took uh, one of those oxycodones, but they were like laced with fentanyl, and I didn't know. And um, he was like, "Yo, just take this or whatever, blah blah." I'm like it ain't nothing. So I took it, and then like I I felt like I I wanted to move, but I couldn't move. Like I felt my vision going away, but I I could see what's in front of me, and I could see him on the floor foaming out his mouth and I just see like the ambulance like <laughs> start shocking Whoa. him back to life yeah shout out Antoine he you know what I'm talking about I, I'm li and, I, and I'm literally I can't even move like cause like the whole time I'm the, what I'm thinking is yo I gotta stay awake I can't if I close my eyes it's it, over with yeah you know what I'm saying and I was like 17 you know what I'm saying Scary and shit, then uh, besides that just like Making Death Star Two just the lean shit, the lean shit, man. Like that, that lean shit is that lean shit is bad. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Like yeah, you can just shut lean. down. You can just shut down with it, man. You just shut, shut down, down, man. Stomach, everything. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah, kills your stomach. So you're saving money. 
what's the ambition with that money we're going to spend it on shit man Cribs. i want to i want to invest in something bro i don't know what yet i don't know exactly what i want to invest in yet i might build a studio i want to do a, i want to do a lot of things man i want to do mm. a lot of things you know i think i actually want to buy like maybe like seven sports cars and rent them Classics, out. Classics, yeah. Oh, rent them out. And rent them That's out. That's Miami, man. Exotic. Exactly. That's something I want to do. Something like that. Mm, mm. But if somebody crashes my whip, I'm gonna slap the fuck out oh, of you with a pistol. Why wouldn't you, man? Get your man to put some voodoo on them. Yeah, I'm um, car and put that wool on you. <laughs> For real. And maybe you should get your manager some donuts, maybe a donut factory or something for your manager. Yeah, my manager will throw yeah. donuts. Josh will throw donuts at you. <laughs> yeah, for real. And there's a lot of donuts. Yeah, well, man. Shout out Mogul Vision, man. He really. If he didn't, if he didn't tell me to slow down, I don't know where I would be right now. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I don't know where I would be. Real talk. Yeah, you wouldn't have made the tour. I wouldn't have made life. <laughs> 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 I wouldn't have made life. But so good to see you, family. Appreciate yeah. that love, man. You already know, Thank man. You, Happy and sober. Yeah, man. Could you end it for us? Tim Westwood TV. Yes, get it. Thank you, fam.